Hey guys, Prepper Nurse One here. Today is April 30th. It's Thursday, the last day of April. We're into May next week, tomorrow actually. So, um, I wanted to talk to you guys today. Um, okay, we see in the news a, a tremendous amount of negativity day in and day out. Um, it gets real depressing, it gets frustrating, and it's scary. Okay, but I want to talk about your lives. Talk, I'll talk about my life, okay? Um, life is what we make it. Now, having said that, other obviously circumstances come into effect on that economic, um, health, you know, and those factors definitely play into how your life is. But I, I'm a firm believer in we all have choices and life is what we make it. Um, if you want to have a miserable existence and be negative all the time and to be sad and depressed, well, then you're going to be. But if you decide that you are going to be a positive person and, you know, a happy person and a successful person, that's all right here. That's all a personal choice. Now, is everybody going to be successful? Is everybody going to be happy? No. Because they're going to come up with excuses why they can't be. Okay? You know, some of the happiest people that I've met in my life are the ones that have the least. You know, they they just have a joy and a vibrance about them. And they're happy. They're happy because they're alive. They're happy because they have good health. They're happy because they have their families. You know? And, uh... Those are good reasons to be happy, you know. Um, being positive is, is such a important thing in life. Um, when you're a doom and gloomer and you're negative all the time, people don't want to be around you. But if you put out that positive vibe and that positive energy, that's going to come back to you too. Um, you know, treating people the way you want to be treated. I've always, that's one of my favorite things in, in, of, of all time. My grandparents used to always say that, treat people the way you want to be treated. And I always think about that, you know, how am, I, how am I projecting myself? Am I treating people the way I would want them to treat me? And so I try to be a positive person. Now, granted, don't get me wrong, nobody's ever positive all the time. You know, um, you're going to have tests in life that are going to test you to the core. Uh, and you're going to go, why me? Why did this happen to me? But I, I think that everything is a test. And it's a choice. Um, you know, basically the decisions we make in our life are completely and 100% up to us, you know. Um, you can have excuses of, of why you weren't able to do this or weren't able to do that. And you'll feel comfortable about that with yourself, with your excuses. I, I'm not making excuses, you know. Um, it, it's just like with me going to live off-grid. You know, there's a lot of people that say, you know, you need to do this, you need to do that, you need to do the other thing, you know. And, uh, and of course, everything takes money. Um, everything takes time. And, uh, you know, I'm going to do the best that I can. And if I come up short, then I'm just going to keep pushing on. Um, it's all about positive mental approach and positive mental attitude. You know, I know that we're going to be successful. I know it's going to take hard work. I know it's not going to be easy. But the thing is, it's like I'm determined, and I'm stubborn. And so, you know, I'm going to make those changes, and I'm going to do what's necessary. Um, you know, obviously having a job and being back to work are a huge, huge positive for me personally. Um, you know, not having a job and not working, it absolutely stinks. You know, but uh, am I making as much money as I would like to? Of course not. Nobody ever does. But I have money coming in, and it's not just going out all the time. So that's a positive thing, in my opinion. So, you know, it is, this is just more of, take a look at yourselves. I want you guys to take a look at yourselves and say, what do I need to do in my life, in, in personally, at your, at your own self, and say, what changes do I need to make to be a, a more positive person? What changes do I make um, to be a more successful person? And if you start making those small little changes... You're going to find that life is going to be better for you. It really, really will. And, and, and I believe that good things happen to good people. 
And I think it's all about, like I said, it's like if you put that positive vibe out there, people want to be around you. If you put out a negative vibe, people don't want to be around you, you know. So, you know, I'm a big believer in being happy. Um, I want to be happy. Um, I choose to be happy, you know. Um, I'm blessed. I have, you know, two healthy kids with zero health problems. Now, at the same thing, I could say, well, I have a son with autism, and it's very, very difficult, okay? And this is hard, and that's hard, and I can make excuses of why things suck, okay? But you know what? I choose not to. I choose to look at my son and say, okay, yes, there are some challenges there, and there are some difficulties, but I'm blessed with this healthy boy that I love very much and that I'm going to do everything in my power that he has a positive and happy life. The same thing can be said with my daughter. My daughter is like the perfect child. She's a straight A student, you know. Um, she's a good kid. She has a wonderful heart. She has a beautiful soul. And, you know, um, it's just, you know, I'm blessed to have her in my life. I was given her for a reason, you know. And, uh, and she's just, and she, you know, she's an inspiration to me, you know. And hopefully, you know, she looks at me and says, you know, this is, who, this is a person who I want to be like. You know, that's what my goal is, that, that she's a good person, you know, and that she's a kind person and she has a good heart. But she's not a sucker. I don't want her to be a sucker, you know what I mean? But, uh, you know, life is difficult, and, and it can be. But it, it, if you surround yourself with good and positive people, you can be a very happy person. I choose to be happy. I, you know, we're only here for such a short time. Let's be positive. Let's be happy. Let's enjoy this thing, okay? Um, and, it, and it can be anything. Enjoy the little things. I mean, just that video that I did the other day with the chickens, okay? I don't know if you guys heard how much I was laughing in that video. I mean, I was belly laughing from the deepest parts of me. They were just being silly girls. And it was fun. And, you know, and, and that joy that they have, you know, in being silly and not caring what anybody else thought, that rubbed off on me and I just laughed so hard it was unbelievable but that's what it's about guys that's what it's about those simple little things that can make us happy so you know enjoy your lives please do you know look at the positives do things positively with your kids and with your family members that you care about that's what it's all about it really is it's real simple I mean you know I hate to break it down so simply but that's what it is it's about joy in, in being around positive, happy people, you know, that's what you want to surround yourself with. All right, guys, well, you know what, thanks for listening. Um, you know, this is a kind of a rah-rah motivational type of talk today, um, and I hope it helps, okay? Prepper Nurse went out for now.